Hi, today we're going to take a look at the Knowledge Base feature. This is a new section of iSpring Learn where you can upload work instructions, job aids, user manuals, or add links to online resources. And all this information can be easily accessed by your trainees who enter the learning portal. Let me show you how it works. Once you're logged in, the first thing you'll need to do is enable Knowledge Base. Head on over to Settings, and then go on over to Additional Options. Here, find the Knowledge Base section. From here, you can check this box to enable the feature. Don't forget to hit Save. You'll see a new section appear in the menu. Let's select it to take a closer look. From here, you can upload and store different types of training materials to the Knowledge Base. To upload content, simply select the Add button and then choose Upload. Now you can select your documents, PDFs, presentations, or even more. It's so easy. It's also possible to add a link. You just have to fill in the title and paste the link you want to share. And voila, now the link will be available to your trainees. You can easily organize your content into folders. Create a folder by selecting the folder button up here. Name it whatever you like. Now just select the files you want to move and choose where you would like them moved to. Now that it's enabled on your platform, trainees will see the knowledge base in their learning portal. If you want to allow your colleagues and teammates to manage the knowledge base as well as add new materials to it, head on over to Users and then Roles. From here you can access your different users' permissions. Just select a role and then head down to their access permissions. Under Knowledge Base, you can enable any access permissions they need. Excellent! Now my trainers can add materials too. And that's how to set up and use the Knowledge Base function in iSpring Learn. This is a great new way to share documents with your learners. Knowledge Base is like a shelf with documents that anyone can take and read at any time. Give it a try!